What's up, gang? It's D here, your friendly neighborhood tattoo VO. And uh, yesterday I was talking about how I look forward to Mondays. And it's true, and I'll tell you why in a moment. It's time to Ink Positive. Tips and insight from the tattoo VO. So a few years ago, actually four years ago, Monday, uh, my wife and I packed up and headed down to Florida from Baltimore. And our lives have improved significantly since doing so. And I'm not just saying it's because of the move, it's because we had a plan in place to take steps to do other things uh, career-wise that would fulfill us and make us prosperous. And for me, it was finally, finally kicking this voiceover thing into full gear. So once we got down here, sort of laying the groundwork, and then by fall of 2017, I was able to launch uh, my voiceover and audio production business. And now, you know, about three and a half years later, it's just brought me so much joy, so much freedom, so much happiness. And my only regret is that I didn't pull the trigger on this dream years earlier. Because back in 2009, I really, really toyed with the idea and just chickened out. So for all of you out there who hate Mondays and aren't really happy with, you know, what you're doing in life, um, it's never too late to make that change. Look, I'm 42. I was in the same business for almost 15 years, uh, and I was very happy in it for the most part till the last couple of years. And then I didn't know what I was doing when that fell apart. So I bounced around doing a few other things that it's just it wasn't me. Uh, it didn't get me in here. It didn't get me up here. And it just drained me and made me dread those Mondays. So uh, I just want to thank everybody, too, while I'm here, all my clients, all my colleagues, all my coaches, producers, Anybody who's watching this right now, my friends, family, who've supported me doing the Tattoo VO thing and, uh, you know, who's really helped me grow this because it's tremendous. And I encourage anybody, again, who's looking to make a change to just go for it. You can do it. You don't have to dive in head first. You know, take some time, work on some things, plant those seeds, and maybe start getting your new thing going while you're doing your current thing. And like many of us, then you can make that transition to the full time and then next thing you know, you'll look back and time has gone by and you'll be like, wow, I wish I'd done this sooner because I feel fulfilled and happy. And that's how you keep shining. Thank you all.